Hello everyone, Jack here from Second Gear, and welcome yourselves back to Dead by Daylight. So, third episode, third killer. Well, starting things off with anyway. And this is the Trapper. So this is actually the killer from the beta. Unfortunately, we don't actually have any blood points to be able to upgrade him any, like any more, or any more than he is. So we're just going to be rocking with a bare bones bear trap, which uh, immobilizes and injures trapped victims. He's probably one of the easiest one, uh, easiest killers to use, considering anyone that got the beta would know exactly how to use him. But we are nearly killer rank 19. We really need to actually play this either on stream or just in between episodes just to get a crap ton of blood points. Why are people leaving? I don't understand. Is it is it my face? Come on. My mask isn't that bad. Can we actually change anything on him? Nope, just got the cleaver. Evan. His name's Evan? A twisted soulless mask hides the bearer's face. What became of the man behind the mask? Well, okay. Uh, we have a level 13 survivor rank 20 with a med kit and we got a level 1 Okay, yep. I hope you stay. <laughs> right, we got level 19, or Survivor Rank 19, level 12. Come on. And I did actually only find out... There we go, we got a full team. Three me uh, three Megans, though, which kind of, uh, kind of sucks. Never mind. But yeah, we found out last episode that specific survivors actually have access to the specific items. So obviously, uh, Claudette Morel has the flashlight, unless, uh, unless she gets another item from the... Like either a chest or a mystery box. Megan has the med kit. Dwight has the toolbox. And I forget the fluffy kit. What's the fluffy kit called? I, I call him fluffy kid, obviously, because of the beard, the fuzzy hair. I think he has the map. Whatever hit Jake. Jake has the map. Okay, so we got level 6. Rank 20, 20, 20, 20. Alright, I can handle this. Just stay in the lobby. God damn it. Sorry for the lack of content as well, guys, the last couple of days. I've just been swamped because if you start an, if you start a new week with like being backlogged, you tend to stay backlogged. But hopefully today we should be able to have Monday and Tuesday's uh, videos up. I'm praying for the love of freaking God. And then tomorrow we should be able to have uh, Wednesdays and Thursdays up. If everything goes to plan. And it should do because Tomb Raider's finished. Uh, the Technomancer, in my opinion, do not buy it. I'm trying to save you money here. It looks like a very likable game, but the cinematics are clumsy. The mouth, um, the mouth movement is atrocious. The combat system's clumsy as hell and incredibly repetitive. I played for half an hour and I was already bored of the combat style. And I really like. Don't get me wrong. I'm not just slamming on a game that's just come out. I really, really wanted to like this. It looked like a really good game in trailer. But in actual gameplay, it's just like, oh, God. It's more or less cringy. Okay, so we're in Torment Creek, and it is Coldwind Farm. Okie dokie. Right, let's get to hunting. But uh, bear traps are pretty easy to lay as well. You just, li oh, you know, I'm going to put it in the cornfield just in case they see it, like right next to the generator. But that's not it. You don't just get one bear trap if you didn't play the beta. You actually get a lot of them. Like, we can see one plumed up there. Uh, we must. Well... No, don't slash it. Sorry, I haven't played as the trapper in quite a while. All right, so we probably want one over here. Just wait. Thank you. Really? Oh, my bad. Oh, shut up! You you can't place them by windows anymore. That just sucks. No, you can't. Holy crap! All right, so they changed a few rules for the trapper. That's fair enough. So I mean, if you put uh, what are they? Bear traps down at every single window. The survivors aren't exactly going to have a chance in hello. So next episode, we will be circulating back round to the hill, Billy. With his chainsaw and his dang mallet. I see you, Megan. I see you, Megan. Come on. Come here. Don't run for me. Don't, I'm not going to hurt you. Come on. Come here. Gotcha. I was about to say, I swear to God, if that doesn't hit. What is she doing? Okay. I'm I'm sorry my I'm sorry my little uh, my little pet, but uh, yeah I think this might be the level one survivor rank twenty for some reason I don't know why she stood still she just did okay all right where's that plume coming from right over there go on struggle all you want the worst bloody camping killers came from the trappers as well because they would just chuck a bear trap right at that 
Okay, right at their feet, and then they're basically screwed. Alright, so we had a noise plume coming from over here, and our trap didn't get sprung. Surely you're not dumb enough to stay here. And I don't actually think anyone's actually going to go save Downstroy? Downstroy? Wait, wait, what? No. You can't... You can't... Whoa, she escaped? No, someone got her off of that because she was on the struggling stage. It's alright, it's alright. We're doing, we're doing okay. Just don't step on your trap. I had an embarrassing moment with that before and it nearly... Well, no, sorry, it did cost me the game. I was carrying... I was carrying the lot. Hello. Oh, come on. I was carrying the very last survivor and uh, I might have trodden on my own trap causing me to drop the survivor and then they jumped down the trap door and I was like, oh, oh, oh. my friend would like refuse to let me or not let me, let it go basically. I saw you. Alright, you're gonna run around this way, are you? You're gonna carry on running. Hello! <laughs> gotcha. Right, she needs to die simply because she has a mate kit. She is a great asset to the team. Don't know why I turned Scottish there, kind of weird. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> you didn't pay attention. You didn't pay attention to your surroundings. Alright, so they got another generator and I've injured two of them now. Well, technically one's about to get strung up. Alright, there you go. You can sit up here. I hear Megan. Megan. I know you're here. Would you happen to be in here? No. Okay, I don't want to be that camping killer, so I'm going to walk away. I don't even care if it costs me the match. It's just it's just courtesy to at least give them a chance. Oh, crap. All right. So they only need two more generators. <laughs> You're an idiot, my friend. Come here, Michael. I'm guessing that's short for Michael. Come on. Come on. I'm not going to bite. Don't worry. You can run over there all you want. Right, he's going to preemptively throw that down and completely screw up his chances. Ah, you didn't stun me. Now all of them are bloody injured. Well, nearly all of them. Right, he's going to jump through there. Oh, don't run around that way. That's not fun for anyone. You jumped back through, didn't you? Yeah, you did. I knew it. Come on, come here. No, 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 no. Don't run. Don't run. I said don't run. There you go. Oh crap, I forgot the one with the bloody med kit's now off the hook. Oh, this sucks. She's healed herself. God damn it, as long as she doesn't get down story, we still should be okay. Come on. Alright, there you go. You know what? I'm going to be a dick. There you go. We're going to play beta rules, alright? Just for you, I'm going to play beta rules. So now when someone actually tries to save him, they're going to step on the trap, spring it, break their ankle. Happy days for everyone. Well, not for him, for me. Alright, so we need to get the medic yet again. Where will she be? Come on. Noise plume, please. That'll be very useful right now. They're working on this one. 100%. Of course, she was strung up over here. I say strung up. Hooked. Whatever you want to call it. Yes! We got down stroke, and that would have put him on his ass as well, or them on their ass. Because they were already injured as what? Since when? If you're injured and you get caught by a bear trap, that puts you on the floor. There's not been any debates about that. That's what it's done. Alright, never mind. Oh, hello. Oh, you lucky, lucky girl. Alright. The chase is on. And we have the medic again. God, who else has a bloody med kit? Or no, they can heal by their hands. It's just quicker with a med kit. I keep forgetting about that. Has everyone just left Downstro? Oh, I see ya. I see ya. I'ma get ya. Hello! <laughs> They're all healed. All of them are healed. This is not good. This is definitely not good for me. I don't know where she went. I don't know where she went. Maybe if I put them down in the dungeon this time. If I catch them, that is. Right, someone screwed, screwed that up. But it's very close to being active. Oh, I don't like this. I think we might actually lose this game, people. But I shall remain opti uh, optimistic, because they only need two. And all of them are alive. One's injured. I'm shocked she hasn't actually healed herself by now. 
unless she's scared because she can hear the heartbeat. Hmm. Not entirely sure. But I don't, we shouldn't even be over by this one simply because it's already on. They're not going to be over there. They're going to be by these two. Or these three. Right. Most likely they're going to stand right here. Facing everything else. And just checking to make sure that I'm not there. Alright. So we got a couple traps down. Now we just got to check up on... Oh my god, why are the generators so spread out? God damn it, someone healed her. Or she healed herself. Either way, doesn't matter. I'm a catcher. Don't you think I won't? Would someone be in here? No. All of our progress has basically been reversed. This sucks. Okay, they're most likely going to be over at this one then. Damn depth of field. Can you just zoom in? Or not zoom in, just be a little bit clearer. Alright, we've got a trap there. Don't stand on it yourself, you idiot. Where the hell are these people going to be? I haven't even seen Dimitri. Alright, we've got a plume. And I'm pretty sure someone just deactivated. Yep, someone... Someone broke my goddamn bear trap. I see you, Dwight. Come on, boy. Don't play hard to get. Don't play hard to get. Where do you think you're going to go? Run double back on me, are you? Oh, I think not. No, no, no. I'm gonna cut you, boy. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Come on. What was that? He's gonna go back over the grate. Please break it quicker. Oh, he's gone. He's definitely gone. Son of a bitch. Come on. In here? No. No, we lost him. And they only need one more generator. This is appalling. This honestly sucks. All right, can I just chuck this down here? Just in case I go for this one. See, they've played kind of smartly here because now the three generators that they have left are quite spread out. So it's going to take me time to get around to each of them. No one's even working on this one, so they've got to be going for that one. They have to be. Damn, I should have chased Michael. Right, the trap's still there, and someone has briefly worked on that generator. Peekaboo! Haha, <laughs> I got you down, Stroy. Come on, boy. One more trip on the hook and you'll cut and it's curtains for you. I'll turn you into a new nice mask. Come on. Don't you want to be my mask? There you go. Alright, so now next time you go on a hook, which is going to be very shortly, you're going to die. Or you should do, unless the rules have changed again. Well, luckily, you have a hook right here. And I'm pretty sure you're familiar with this one. Wasn't this one I put you on last time? There you go. Yep, one dead. Problem is... You know what? You know what? No, hello. Cheeky. Cheeky. There's no pallet there either for you. Nope, there you go. And there's Dimitri. We haven't seen Dimitri all bloody game. Why, hello. Come, let me show you my hooks. Don't worry, they're clean-ish. But I just did think of something that I used to do in the beta while I was playing as a trapper. And that is to actually pick up a trap and lay it in front of the escape door. Or in front of the escape switch. So, which it basically only leaves one for me to watch. Which just cuts my workload in half. Alright, we're going to go back and check on Dimitri. Because I don't want him getting off the hook. No, you're okay. Hopefully, we're going to be able to see another survivor. If we can find the door, that would be fantastic. Wait, I see one. I just noticed. Oh, God, look at the pigs in the trees. Oh, God. That's just grim. And someone plucked him off the hook. That's okay. It was to be expected. Right. There you go. Have a nice trap at the gate. So even if you do get one more generator, it doesn't matter. Oh, great. And then they healed Dimitri too. You team playing pricks. It's nice to see a team that actually works together, though. Other than Downstroy, it seems that... Um, well, it, it was probably like one of their first games, so... Bit of noobery is to be expected. 
Dimitri, you should not have stayed in the same area. Oh, no, you should not have. Come on, come here. Come here, don't, don't you run from me. There you go, and I saw you, Dwight. Oh, I saw you. Where are you? Don't worry, it's safe to leave her there. Kinda. You know what, no, you've already been on the hook once. That means your next trip on the hook means death for you, Dimitri. Come on, I'll take you over here. This one's much cleaner, I'm pretty sure you'll like it. Oh, I rate it four out of five stars? Oh, so hopefully that's gonna be more to your liking. There you go. Now, Dwight, I know I saw you. I'm 100% sure I did. You're lurking around here waiting for me to hook someone. Come on, where are you? I saw you. Peekaboo! <laughs> I just saw your jacket. Oh, that's beautiful. Nope. Oh, I'm about to get two bears with one stone. Right, so I'm going to run around here and then he's going to bait me through the gap. Come on. Yes! Gotcha. Alright, you stay there because most likely Dimitri... No, 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 no. I don't know what you guys are doing. All right, she's jumping through there. She's going around there. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Where'd she go? I heard someone jump. All right, Dwight, you stay right there. She's going to try and save you for the altruism points. Don't worry, I know her game. Oh, you're right here. Okay, you know what? Here you go. Third time on the hook. This should be you. There you go. Now, Dwight, my boy. Where'd you go? You're over here. I can hear you. Where is he? Right. No, 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 no. Well, I'm not having this. Afraid not. Where is Dwight? I think I just saw him there. I heard him whimper. Come on. Where are you? Where would he have gone? Obviously, she's going to try and heal him, but you can't crawl very quickly. Oh, hello. You were trying to hide. Why, bless you. You know what? You can have, um... Look, look, he is... The, the, the girl with the med kit. You can have her hook. There you go. And you know what? I'll just go find another one. So you can have this trap for now. And then we need to pick up another trap then lay at the other gate, which is over here. Oh, he's dead. Okay, that works too. So now, if I run over here, I love what happens to the trees when a soul gets taken. It's beautiful. Alright, so we've got to trap at one of the... Wait, what? Hold on. Did, did the other person leave? You coward, you needed one generator, that's it. And now we're killer rank 19. Fantastic, I need... 18 more to go. We should actually get... Wow, we've got 20,000 blood points now to use. That's pretty good. Are we top of the leaderboard? Yeah, altruism points. Look at that. 17,000, but we topped it with 18. See, I, I actually kind of prefer the trap because there's no gimmicks like turning invisible or a freaking chainsaw that makes you sprint. It is literally as good as you can track and trap. That's basically it. So now we are actually playing as Megan. We were playing as... Uh, Claudette, who has the flashlight, but now Megan uh, Megan has the first aid kit, and well, I love to play the hero part, so why not? We must actually upgrade her just a little bit, and by a little bit, I mean all of our points. All of them. Okay, we might as well grab another first aid kit. The lightweight perk is pretty good, just makes you uh, running as light and soft, making your tracks harder to follow. So that's pretty good. And we get a common offering, might as well get the gloves add-ons, the rubber gloves. Slightly decreases the healing skill check difficulty, which is cool. An uncommon add-on. A wooden stamp with a crosshatch rubber pad, uh, pad used to mark documents. It is unclear as to how or by whom this stamp was originally used can be used with a map. Moderately increases the range of the map tracking ability. Okay, that's pretty cool. Don't know why we... Unless I'm wrong and it is still randomized items, which I really hope. No, she gets a medkit again. Okay, you know what? It doesn't matter. We have now got another add-on to put onto this, so we might as well use the rubber gloves. As well as objectives. Yeah, we'll play objectively. I don't see why not. And we've got... We'll make it. Yeah, okay. 
Right, join lobby. So we're gonna obviously round things off with another survivor run. Oh dear god, what happened there? Alright, we just got thrown back out. That's fine. As long as it doesn't crash, I'm happy. Oh, I'm just dreaming of seven days to die. I need to I need to know where our journey's gonna take us next. And I actually booted up seven days to die before this by mistake. I was like, oh yes, now we get to play some Dead by Daylight. And it was like, oh wait. Please let me join a lobby. Can you stop this? Just let me join one. Oh my god, I'm a mutant. What the hell has happened to Megan? <laughs> she has a head in her chest, a chest on her head. What? Alright, there we go. Rank 20s and a rank 19. And we're a 20 as well, so I'm fine with this too. Okie dokie. Match begins. I wonder what kind of killer we're going to have. Personally, I really want to get the hillbilly. Because the hillbilly is so intense. And he's a bastard to get away from. Granted, the last game in the last episode with the Wraith, oh my god. That had me on the edge of my seat. I was just like, has he seen us? Please, don't do it. <laughs> oh, it's so much fun. Ah, oh, I love this game. It, they fixed the majority of their issues. And if, I know I've said this like the last two episodes, but um, if anyone is having trouble with the game crashing when you do anything in game, if you have a controller hooked up to it, if it's on PC, I don't know if this game's for console yet or not, I'm not entirely sure. Unplug the controller. Learn to use a keyboard. I know some people have been able to play it without having to sacrifice a controller, but ever since I've unplugged mine and kept mine unplugged, it's been touch wood. It's been working absolutely perfectly, which is fantastic. And now that I said that, it's going to crash when I hit the first generator, isn't it? Okay. I'm not hearing any bells. I'm not hearing any... Yeah, that was my chainsaw impression. And what? No, it was, it was atrocious, I know. Is there a generator up here? Wow, this house is really cool. And someone's already here. Why, hello, Dwight. Oh, dear God, we're screwed, aren't we? I haven't heard any bells or a chainsaw. So, instinctively, that would tell me we're dealing with a trapper. I hope not, because trappers are, as, as we know, pretty good. And people who got the beta definitely know how to use them. Especially people with the beta. Efficiently, too. A thousand points for the repairs. Holy crap. Right, quick. Get downstairs. Get out. Uh-oh. 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 Run! What are we dealing with? It is a trapper. I was right! Um, um. He ran after those guys, but I don't know where I should go. Alright, he's still following him. No, I'm just going to carry on. Uh-oh. He's going to... Oh, oh, oh. Nope. Nope. Nope, I'm out. I'm out. Check, please. Oh, shut up. He's going for me. He bait... No, I baited myself, let's be honest. Oh, crap. Please... Wait, did I lose him? Oh god. Oh god. The music keeps kicking in. Okay, he's over there. Alright, come on then. Whoop! There you go. Haha, <laughs> gotcha. Okay, he's either going to have to break the pallet or go round, and I doubt he's going to go round. No, I doubt he's going to break it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't let me anger any crows, I beg of you. Alright, I think we lost him. Oh, that was good. If you ever need, like, an adrenaline rush, rush, this game just does it for you. Even though it is a tiny amount of adrenaline, it's just like, oh, it's nice. That sounded so weird, didn't it? I didn't... I <laughs> I didn't mean it that weird, uh, like to be that weird, but um, holy crap, we're just running around in circles. Everyone else is getting all the generators. No worries, we'll jump on this one. Ooh, it's already halfway done, too. Really, we should have prioritized generators and not uh, messing about with the killer, simply because of the amount of points we're going to get for this. Okay, a bit of cooperation of repairs, too. Pepsi Man. Now, I'm tempted to save you. I really am. I think I might have to try. Once. You dick. Even though I know if I mess it up, I'm like, oh no, I'm sorry. But still, it was that close. Come on. 
Right, we're going to have to try. Come on, please someone come with me. Someone needs to bait the killer if he's going to be a camper. He's going to be a camper, isn't he? Yeah, look, there he is. I'm sorry. I'm not even... No. If you've got a camping killer there, there is zero point trying to save someone. Because that killer ain't going nowhere. They need to... I don't know what, what they can even do to uh, actually stop camping killers. Like they, I don't think there is anything you can do unless you put an aura around the hook after someone's been put on there. Just so there's a minimum distance so the killer can't come with it like inside of. But then it makes it too easy to save people. Alright, I'm getting the switch. The switch is mine. I want the points. I'm greedy. Yes, I know. Leave me alone. Nope, my switch. Mine. Did you get like uh, 2,500 points for actually opening the switch? Yeah, he's still going to be over there. He's just going to keep camping, uh, camping his one survivor he's actually managed to kill. Shameful. It is actually shameful. Sweet. Doors open. Do we run or... Well, we can't save him. I mean... He got hurt. You got hurt. Where the hell were you guys? Just come here. Oh, God. They tried to save Pepsi. Oh, no. Pepsi's off the hook. Pepsi is off the hook. All right. All right. We gotta go then. We gotta try. No soldier left behind. Okay, he's been picked up again. Nope, he's dead. He's dead this time. Second time on the hook. I'm sorry. Keep running backwards and forwards like, I don't know what to do. You know what? I'm gonna be greedy. I'm gonna go find the other gate and get more points. Why not? Hold on, hold on. You, come here. You. No. Come here. Best thing is I can't actually struggle out if uh, the killer comes. Run. Run. Come on. Come on now. I want to humiliate you. Come on. Come here. Come here. Come on. He knows. What are you doing? Now you're going to wait for me to get real cocky and come close, aren't you? Wait a sec. Alright, that's one way you can boost points. Apologies. Didn't know that was going to happen, but you actually get continuous points for being chased and escaping. So, that's that's a thing. Uh, guys, I think you might need to fix that. You know what? First time we've actually been out to spectate. Let's spectate Juanchos. Juanchos? I don't know. Come on, you got this. We have to see a match through to the... You were not in the basement. You idiot! You saw me open the gate! What are you doing in the basement? Oh, come on. Please don't, don't, don't play yourself like this. Just find the gate I open and get through it, please. I want to see you live. Think it, what? Or are you farming points? You're farming points, aren't you? You dirty rat. This is, this is disgusting. No, I, I'm not watching this. That's, that's just disgusting. Do you really want to mid-max those points that bad? And Grill Bandit is now playing Counter-Strike. If that name sounds familiar, it's the one we kind of caught mid-animation jumping into the hole. But uh, guys, I'm afraid that's going to do it for this episode as per usual. One killer, one survivor run. Maybe we might do a stream on Sunday of this. I am undecided, but let me know what you think about that in the comment section down below. And of course, if you did enjoy the episode, be sure to drop a like down below as well. And finally, guys, if this is the kind of content that you do enjoy to watch, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already, because we are back up to 117 subscribers, and I'm proud to have each and every one of you beautiful little gears in our lovely little, little family. And of course, if you do decide to subscribe, you get the added bonus of actually being able to keep up to date with all of our content. And if you're new here, we actually upload three videos a day, seven days a week, seven ongoing series, and it's bloody fantastic stuff, and I very much enjoy making content for you guys. But anyway, thank you all for watching, and until next time, I shall see you all later.